The enzymes cellulase and hemocellulase are becoming very popular for the treatment of chronic candida. Does this really make sense though? In my opinion it doesn't. It actually poses several problems. First of all, the principle behind using hemocellulase and cellulase in the treatment of candida is to digest the cell wall of the candida organism, thereby killing it. This part, in essence, doesn't make sense until you think about the fact that when you break down cellulose and hemicellulose with these enzymes, you're actually generating simple sugars that are going to turn around and feed the surviving candida. The second problem we run into is that we need fibers in order to feed our intestinal flora. Now our intestinal flora will take fibers and it ferments these fibers to generate beneficial acids. These acids will keep candida in its benign yeast form instead of its pathogenic fungal form. The fungal form occurs when the system becomes too alkaline, usually because we kill off the intestinal flora. Now again, the flora need to sit there and ferment these fibers in order to generate these acids. But if you're taking cellulase and hemicellulase, it's going to digest these fibers that would normally feed the intestinal flora and it's going to break them down into simple sugars that are going to turn around and feed the candida instead of feeding the intestinal flora, which we need to form those acids.